This is so I like it. Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. How are you all doing today? My returning subscribers, thank you for keep coming back. If you are new to this channel and you have not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. <laughs> if you have already subscribed, thank you for joining us. So in today's video, we'll be making a foriro like a uh, vegetable. So I've been wanting to make this soup for a while. But today I'm going to be making my own version of a foriro. So before then, if you are not following me on Instagram, hey, follow me now, Miss Fini in America. I'm always there and I respond to every message. I also have a uh, Facebook. Follow me on Facebook also, Miss Fini in America. So let's talk there. <laughs> so now I'll be showing you what I'll be using for this uh, F4 room. So let me show you my ingredients that I'll be using for this uh vegetable soup all right come on so as you can see we have <laughs> cow legs bomo and i'm gonna i'm going to be using three tomatoes it's very big and then i have a uh, chili red tomato uh, chili ready tomatoes and I have snare and the lim uh, lime that I'm going to be using to clean the snare. I have uh, Lucas beans. So this is the pepper I have. Uh, I don't have the ripe one. So I'll be using this. It's been inside the freeze the freezer for a while. And then I have uh, onions, half onions. I'll be using white onions. And this one is dried fish, like stock fish crayfish and prawns and the bonga fish and then we have my crayfish is just one and here we have salt and mangin to taste we have sweet pepper i'm just going to be using one sweet pepper and uh, we have ugu leaf you can see the name there ugu and palm oil so this is the palm oil this one is blended crayfish I just put it here in case maybe I want to use it <laughs> and then this is the green leaf that we'll be using today so without no wasted time the pot everything is ready for this food and let's get started and before then I will be boiling this meat and then let's start let's just do it now I want to start boiling the the meat so I'll put the tomatoes there so here is the pot that I'll be using for this meat I'm just gonna put them here because I already cleaned the meat cow leg so I'm just gonna put the, boil the two together so guys I want to add salt to the meat I'll be careful <laughs> so I'll add margin non margin to it So I'll cover it to boil. So while the meat is boiling, I want to quickly slice the veggies, the vegetable. All right. Slice it like this. I 
like it tiny though because I like it when it's there for me to bite because you know when you cook it sometimes it can just melt because this is not the ugu because the ugu leaf is really strong it's thicker than this one I'm going to clean it now with water. I already cleaned up the green and the uh, funky leaf, which is Google leaf. So right now I want to start blending the tomatoes and pepper because the meat is boiling. So I just want to cut it into four parts.
I want to start cleaning the, the snail. So let me first of all try the meat and then I'll start. make the uh, vegetable soup add red uh, oil palm oil so I shake it already and I'm just going to let it melt look how things uh, I still have some left I just want to add Tomatoes. I don't want the, the water and the juice to go in, I just want the base.
looking beautiful guys <laughs> and it smells good so now I'm going to be adding blended crayfish be adding my gin I'll be adding this one uh, crayfish my gin Test it is uh, there's no sauce, so I can add more to it. But for now, I think that's okay. So I'll leave, let, leave everything now to boil or to cook for about another 10 minutes before I add the vegetables to it because those ones is not hard to cook. So I'll leave all these ones. To cook so the vegetables will go last I'm covering it so guys it's time to add the vegetables to the sauce and now I want to add the ugu, ugu leaf which is funky leaf the green to it and press the water out of it because you see the reason why I did not add water to that tomatoes today you can see even as that I did not even add water to it even the water I used to boil meat I didn't add it you can see it's very light it's not thick yet so I did not add water from the beginning, even as now, I could never add water to it. So I'm just going to turn it. I'm going to stir it so that everything will go uh, down so that it will cook. 
looking good. I smell it good already.